الحمد لله والصلاة والسلام على نبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم ما بعد. Before it's too late, as every one of us will die, spend in the cause of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. As Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in Hadith al Qudsi, Anfak ibn Adam wa unfak, unfak ilayk. As Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, as narrated in the Hadith al Qudsi from the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, to spend, O son of Adam, and I will spend upon you. And we learn from this Hadith narration, that our wealth will not, uh, we will not lessen the value of our wealth, nor will we lose our wealth, but rather we will gain if we spend it on Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala's creation and those people in need. As this is the time to do so, it is imperative we cannot afford to wait even a minute more because as they relate in some of the statistics that 30,000 children have died in Somalia alone in the past month. Then this shows us that this is a dire crisis. People are in dire need. They are dying. These are human beings. These aren't flies. These aren't uh, rats. And these are not uh, animals. That animals that we detest like snakes and, the, and scorpions and things like this but rather these are human beings these are our sons and daughters these are the children of the human family that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has created us created us to worship him so worship him by spending in the cause of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in the Quran Allah yudhunnu ulaika annuhum mad'uthun liyawman azim yawman yukumun nasa li rabbil alameen Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says do they not think that they will uh, that they will be resurrected? Meaning that after we die, we will be resurrected. There's a day of judgment we'll face. Liyom and Azim. In the great day, the day of judgment. This is the day when the people will stand before their Lord subhanahu wa ta'ala and be judged. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will look to us and look to see our deeds. Did we believe in Him or not? Did we spend in his cause? Did we have the ability to help alleviate the suffering of someone else? And we didn't, we chose not to do so. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is gonna, going to judge you based upon that. So this is an encouragement for myself and others to spend while we have this blessed opportunity, especially in this blessed month of Ramadan. And I ask Allah the Almighty to forgive us of our sins. Anything I said that was correct was from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And anything that I said that was incorrect was from myself and the shaitan. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless us to be a means to encourage one another to spend in the cause of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and alleviate the suffering of our fellow human beings, our sons and daughters of, men, uh, of the children of Adam. وصلى الله وسلم على نبينا محمد